Okay, very good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to my new video. Welcome again to my YouTube channel. Uh, thank you again for your likes. Thank you for your subscriptions, subscribes, whatever. And in this video, I would like to talk a little bit about MLM companies. And the first will be uh, Mind.Capital. I was the member of that one, but before we start, I want to ask you to hit that like button and uh, also the subscribe button. And that's how you're going to help me grow my channel. And many, many people will see very interesting videos that I'm making here. So in, uh, in uh, this video, like I said, I'm going to talk about the Mind Capital. And the Mind Capital is the Spanish company that I work with and uh, many people I know. So basically, uh, we are not sure what's happening with them and most probably that uh, that was a huge scam. So basically, I want to explain, I want to simplify for everybody that understand how these platforms are working and uh, uh, most easier way to explain is that uh, they take the Bitcoin, actually we give them the Bitcoin, we give them our Bitcoin because the payments goes through the Bitcoin. They do not accept the cards and anything else because that is that sorry that is a legal issue and they can be prosecuted uh, in many countries the bitcoin is still not recognized as a currency so what they're doing they're accepting the bitcoin accepting the cryptocurrency and uh, once when you send the, the that crypto to their site uh, they will uh, uh, let's say like this they will change they will change the uh, your currency, your cryptocurrency in the US dollars or in the euros, it depends which company is in, uh, is in which business and uh, they will promise you basically daily or monthly earnings. So I'm not just saying about the mine capital, there is many various platforms and uh, uh, they do the same principle. Some of them, they say they invest in different things. They have, uh, they're generating the, the profits and the uh, returns and usually they leave some space for themselves so when they pull out when they try to actually when they succeed of uh shutting down the platform or one whatever they want to do when they want to escape with the money or whatever they leave it uh, uh, always some some time let's say you cannot pull out your initial deposit for let's say three months or for two weeks or there is always some certain time that you cannot take out the money and that much is for them enough to pull out money, to turn off the site or do whatever they want. So uh, what happened here, many people are asking me what's going on and I, w I decided to, to make the video to explain how these things are working. Uh, basically, they take the Bitcoin, they store the Bitcoin, they keep it somewhere. They don't sell that Bitcoin because what they did, they know that the Bitcoin will grow up. So many people invested in this platform my capital and they invested around uh, 2019 2020 and the bitcoin in that time was 10 11 12 14 thousand dollars so what they did they managed to maybe as they did staking or they stake the the bitcoin in any platform or in other platforms or like let's say today you have binance you have many many exchanges where you can stake your bitcoin and you get uh, let's say um, you can get a loan uh, or you can get uh, uh, you are getting also the the percent for stake for staking your crypto so it depends on some platforms there is eight percent twelve percent depends how how long are you staking for example if you stake for let's say longer period of time if you stake let's say for a year you will get uh, let's say 30 40 percent. Uh, a year returns something like that so these people are smart and uh, what they did they accept our bitcoins when the price was 10 12 15 000 20 000, let's say and uh, when the when the bitcoin goes above 60 000 60k they decided that's enough and uh, they said 
that they cannot work anymore or they invent something always there is some things that they can invent and they said that uh, the platform basically that their bot isn't for the for the trading or actually no they had a bot for the arbitrage and uh, that bot is not going to work anymore they have some issues they have some problems so basically what they did they want to wash their hands they want to pay out all the money they owe to the people but what they want to pay they want to pay you the value of the bitcoin when you invested so if you invested let's say when the bitcoin was ten thousand and let's say two months ago the bitcoin was sixty thousand so now they're not going to give you back uh, the value of sixty thousand dollars they will give you back let's say if you invested hundred dollars uh, at that time and now it's worth nine hundred or thousand or two thousand no they will give you back hundred dollars that's it plus minus the commissions and everything else so uh and now in this moment they have for sure they have a ending period of staking or something like that and they can they can pull out let's say certain amount of the of their bitcoin they can swap or sell for the usdt or any other currency the stable coin and they're in the plus so basically they take the people's bitcoin by the low price they stake it they weigh it and once they wait until the certain time so when they when they receive i mean when they when the staking was over or bitcoin price was reached the one they wanted so what they did they just close everything they close the door they give back to the people uh, whatever they invested and that's it so basically they give back the initial investments of everybody maybe a couple percents of the people still didn't get the money but most probably everybody will and uh, and that's it that's the story of the mine capital so here as you can see this is a certificate they say that i invested let's say eleven thousand basically they calculated that i invested eleven thousand dollars there in that time and uh, no matter how much the, <laughs> how much is the the value today and uh, they take out let's say all the profits if all not the profits actually uh, during that time how much uh, let's say i was pulling out every day or every couple of days that much and the mac coin is actually the dollar the one dollar is one mac coin so let's say 739 dollars i only take out from this investment of eleven thousand dollars and uh, they take out they said that i already took that so they will um, they were going to make 11,000 minus 739 is going to be 10,290. So basically they just give back to the people the initial deposit and that's it. No matter how much you earn, no matter how much you make profit, that's it. So basically they just, <laughs> they just borrow uh, the Bitcoin, something of value that we had, many of us, and uh, they just give it back in let's say in the regular currency so that's one more uh let's call it basically a scam that is made and there is many many others uh there is a website under maintenance and this is finished but most probably in this time of maintenance what they're doing they're doing the cleaning the tracks removing uh, let's say from the site everything that can harm them or potentially i don't know what what they can do and uh, in the before they shut down everything before they stopped they were talking about the new projects about the new bots or about something new so basically for me the mind dot capital mind capital it means that capital as let's say a capital comes from the mind so from somebody's mind this capital came and um, uh basically this is a really nice scam really nice uh, business they did for them because what they did they didn't do nothing illegally they just borrow the bitcoin from regular people they keep it they hold it until the certain time they want it when the price reach let's say sixty thousand fifty thousand whatever they stop so what they did they said that the banks are making the troubles they cannot pull out from certain exchanges they cannot take out the money the crypto they're blocked 
blah 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 and then they decide that they cannot perform anymore and uh, basically that's it once when you do this certificate you're telling you're accepting you're accepting that there is no record of purchasing purchasing operations so what does it say it says that there is no record of anything that you done did with them refunds there is no record of reimbursement operations so basically they 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 said that uh, you never invest we never invested with them and there is nothing happened let's say with them and uh, whatever they did they did legally and there is no any thing that anybody can put them on the court or do something against them so this is a perfectly nice scam nice and amazing scam i mean like uh, uh yeah unbelievable but possible so yeah basically is that they said they are delaying and uh, they delay some so so very long time they did uh, delay of everything they of course they communicate with everybody they talk to the people they said okay calm down everything is going to be okay you will get your initial deposit boom they get they give back not to everybody in the same time but they give back so most probably because they stake in the different exchanges that amount of bitcoin is i mean for sure it's huge because they had more than ten thousand bitcoins in one in one point there is one leader he had i don't know how many millions of dollars and invested with his uh, mlm structure and he's not the only one there is many many leaders with i don't know how many 10 20 million of dollars so basically what they did, the, the mine capital, they stake somewhere this, these Bitcoins and uh, they multiply the Bitcoin or they get the money or they borrow to pay out to the people. They took the loans or whatever. Once the Bitcoin goes up, they settle everything. They sold something. They, they uh, give back the debts and that's it. They give back to the people their own money and uh, people stay without let's say without anything they didn't get the profits they didn't get nothing they just get their own money back i said plus or minus the commission so basically amazing scam amazing scam and uh, yeah that's that's the thing so guys be be aware of any platform because uh there is many 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 platforms uh, in the past let's say one year that i've been through and i've been through the many and uh, i work with the finalmente global from south africa i work with the mine capital from spain and most of them what they did they they pull out the scam they, this is a simple scam i mean they just bought this is the light scam let's say like that because they took the money and they give back something to the people that's it the finalmente global didn't give back anything and uh, they took a huge amount of bitcoins also there is a also the mirror mirror trading from the south africa they were they are the first one who who pulled the rug but also there is the arbister and that's one of the first scams ever the biggest one i mean the big one the big scam is the arbist arbister and uh, they work in the bitcoins also the same like a finalmente global so these platforms guys my suggestion is to stay away because uh, they will have exit, they plan the exit and they, they already have the plan in their heads, in their minds, how they're gonna, uh, how they're gonna exit the end. They will exit. They will exit. Uh, as long as the new and the fresh money comes, they're okay. Everything is okay. As soon as something stops, or let's say the Bitcoin price goes down, like now, for example, uh, most of them, they will stop. They will invent something new. There is also the bull run, the new platform, four months old four or five i don't know something like that and uh, they also talk about trading crypto trading whatever as soon as the bitcoin go down uh they stop they said their their bots are not working perfectly they're inventing something with the banks uh, like i said there is 99 uh, percent of these platforms are scams so uh if you are uh, in the trades if you know how to trade much better to to do by yourself or let's say find the bot and uh, uh, put some money and let the bot uh, do the business for you or if you like you can trade by yourself like i said uh, careful with the investments careful with this 
type of platforms because once they say daily let's say you're gonna get one percent per day you're gonna get monthly 15 percent 10 percent whatever 12 20 30 i even heard about 50 percent per, per month so guys this this that's impossible and uh, based on my experience uh this is 99 percent of scams so i i think i clear a little bit some some uh doubts and uh, i really hope that i'm gonna help many people not to invest in these type of platforms uh, no matter no matter what anybody say whoever says anything believe me guys you will see at the end if you don't exit on time you will be uh <laughs> you will stay without money without investment so the only thing you can use this type of platforms and that's only one thing and it's also risky is that you enter in the beginning of the platform you stay for two three four months stop and you get out you get out you pull out everything you take out your initial investment you take out your profits you take out everything and you leave that forget about it so that is my suggestion and uh, my recommendation to stay away from this type of platforms uh i mean if if these guys well i'm i'm i don't believe but if these guys give back something and they say something around september but most probably nothing they will not gonna give any any profits like they said because people having their uh thousands and thousands of dollars in the in their company and let's call it a company also they opened the new one the mine capital they opened the new one in the kazakhstan or somewhere i don't know where and uh, from that th there is nothing you know there is no 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 new products no new companies basically this is just uh, for the for you know longer extending the time extending the time for them to to make their own exit okay so guys don't forget to like the video don't forget to subscribe if you didn't subscribe and uh, thank you for being with me here tonight and see you in the next video Bam.